Shalom guys. Hello good people of the world. Hi everybody, welcome. And welcome back. And welcome to another video of the BFM channel. So we've been out and about quite frequently recently and we had this grand idea to take you guys along on some of our trips. So we picked this one for you guys. With this trip it was more of a just like a um, family time fun fun family trip and it was it was nice to just sit back and get away from like worrying about oh I got to be on stage. So without further ado, roll the intro. So we're gonna try to keep this as linear as possible. And we'll try to keep the uh, non-interesting parts to a minimal and brief if they are there. But come on guys, everything about this is interesting, really. So, okay, let's get started with that. So we were up pretty early to go to Oklahoma City this time and we didn't have much time to make coffee at home. So on our way to Oklahoma City, we just stopped at the nearby coffee shop, which makes really good coffee. Some of us got the hot stuff, some of us got the cold stuff. I myself prefer that, what is it, English toffee latte. But though the coffee is delicious, they can't compare to the delicious coffee that my wife makes. So one thing I'm definitely always gonna get, what is it called, Oreo? Frappe, no, 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 just grab that. French vanilla with Oreos. I don't know, sometimes I'm torn because there's hot coffees that are just as good and it's cold weather, but the silk things are so good. So I usually just end up going with one of those. Getting coffee, my personal favorite would probably be the, what do you call it? I forgot the name. <laughs> so we stopped by the coffee shop, had a delicious cup of coffee. In my case, cappuccino, two shots of espresso. And, Hit the road once again. So, it appears that there's some sort of obstruction further up the road a wee distance off. It's something's happening up there. I don't know what. I mean, I wish I had a CB radio or something, but not CBD radio. Just not, <laughs> no, no, not CBD radio. <laughs> Crazy. Uh, I don't know what's going on, but there's something up there. The hold up was, uh, I think they had some construction guys doing something on the road, so everyone was driving slow. But at least it wasn't a car wreck. So the first order of business when we get there was to drop Dr. Bailey off at her meeting place. Well, close to it. This is part of the reason why we took two vehicles, because she had to take one and we had to take one away as well. So we took both vehicles then. We left her with one so that she could go to her meeting, tell all the other doctors what to do, <laughs> things like that. And of course we had to stop by a guitar center. I mean, who doesn't stop by a guitar center when you're near one? Benjamin is a really gifted guitarist. 
He can play lots and lots and lots of different guitars, pretty much any type of guitar that's out there. The 12 string, the 6 string, any any type of string instrument that you hold like that, or whatever, he can play. And Daniel, he's the keyboard guy. He's like, any keyboard you give him, he'll mess around on it, figure it out, and then he'll start pumping out any type of tune you ask him for. $2,699? Nope. Do you? Nope. It's a nice keyboard right there. So this is a 12 string. Um, you know, I don't even know what this is. How do you, why do you even pronounce that? I don't even know what this is called. <clears throat> anyway, I've always wanted a 12 string and these things, the reason these things literally sound like magic. You hit, listen to that. It's just open string. They sound like magic. There's like this chant that they have within the within the, the, the very fabric of their wood. It's, it's incredible. I really I really love the guitar. But every time we come to places like this, I I just love to play them because well, they sound amazing. Like seriously. Wellington and stores like that, they're always a uh, go-to when we're near them. Not much good stuff here. So, I'm in sort of doing right now. A problem. I have a problem. I need a specific vest, like dress vest, for a specific date. But every store I've gone to seems to not carry it. So, I'm on a frantic search to find it. And if I don't find it, I'm in trouble. So after we were done visiting those places that we wanted to visit for that day, we went and we picked Dr. Bailey back up. I came up with EQ second name. What's that? EQ Polyboot Bailey. Nope. <laughs> EQ what? EQ Polyboot. EQ Polyboot Bailey. Nope. Yeah, the just EQ. No, just what we dropped. And we went and checked into the hotel. to the hotel, finally. I'm too fat. <laughs> so that was pretty much the ending of that day. We checked into the hotel and we just lounged pretty much for the rest of the day. <laughs> 